listen to that guy. How'd you rate his chops? To my untrained ear, sounds all right, I guess. I mean, it's easy listening at least. No, why? Technique second rate. But the feeling? That's what counts. Guy's hurt, got something he can't take, and it shows. Could stand a little more stage presence. Fingering's all wrong, loses the tempo more than he keeps it, but not that. I really know how to give a guy a compliment. Is that how you got your start? Street busker with big dreams? Don't make me laugh. No time for playing my way to the top. Was too busy shaking the world away. Welcome back to yet another cyberpunk guitar build. I know it's been a while since the last build, but things have changed. Updates have dropped, DLCs came out, and after probably my sixth playthrough, I figured out. Last time I focused on the wrong thing, on the wrong guitar. I focused on some overhyped, nobody knows even who that is anymore, guitar builds, and totally missed out on the most important guitar in the whole of Night City. The most popular guitar, you see it played on the streets, in clubs, in bars, even Carrie plays it. Hell, even Johnny Silverham himself plays it in his spare time. So I'm building yet another cyberpunk guitar, this time from the same materials as last time. Red alder for the body, hard maple for the neck, and ebony for the fretboard, so without further wasting time, let's get to it.
So, long time no talking, huh? The neck is basically completed, just needs the finished sanding before painting. And the body is basically at the same point, just needs a bit of sanding. But also one major component, a metal pig guard that's gonna be inserted into this groove, made out of this plate of steel, 2.5 millimeters. So, we're going to go mill that on the CNC. And the pig guard is made, looks pretty metal, but it also fits. It has a bit of play, but that's good because it's gonna get painted, so we want a nice fit, easy fit. So the guitar has been already sanded to perfection, so now it's time for a coat of paint. For the color, I'm going to use blue all over the guitar except here where it's gonna be silver because it's a cool look. Also, can you use as such color? of guitar, so might as well do it that way. A bit more work, but hey, it's gonna look cool. So first we're going to spray this side with silver, then do a blue cut off here, and then paint the rest of the guitar.
and the painting is finally finished. I topped it off with a nice matte finish and it turned out basically perfectly, so relicking is out of the question for this guitar. It had a month to cure, so now the paint is nice and solid. In the meantime, I prototyped some of the parts for the guitar, like the bridge of the guitar, some string pass-through things, the bridge holder, also these things, which look like an extension of a fretboard on the body of the guitar, so that's neat. So, without further blabbing, let's get to the assembly of the guitar.
So thank you for joining me on yet another epic cyberpunk guitar build. Eternal amazingly, but for the future I might make more cyberpunk guitars or not. So let me know which guitar you want to see me build. Also, if you haven't seen this build, the so-called Anarchist build or the original game name Delusion Orphan guitar build, make sure to check it out because it's also a pretty epic build. But without further ado, thank you for joining me and goodbye.